Hi and welcome to Little People's Montessori Teaching Channel. I'm going to show you how to work with the pig basket. This activity helps with building our fine motor skills, our hand-eye coordination and preparing us for writing. We can also do patterning with this activity and learn about colours. I will now show you how to work with the pig basket. It is important when presenting this activity to the learner that you show them how to hold the pig. Would you like to have a turn? You did it. Would you like to take them off again? Yes. You did it. I like the way you laid the pegs in all different colours. Looks like a rainbow. I like that. We can also use this activity to learn about colours. Can you find a blue peg and peg it on the side of the basket? Can you find a pink peg and peg it on the side of the basket? Can you find a purple peg and do the same? Can you find a turquoise peg and peg it on the basket? We can also use this activity for patterning. For example, one pink, one blue, one pink, one blue, one pink, one blue. Another extension to this activity is learning about a sequence. For example, can you put a purple peg first and then put a blue peg after? Can you repeat that sequence? How many times is this sequence repeated? Two times. Another variation to this activity is learning to follow instructions. I can ask the learner to put two pink pegs and one blue peg and repeat the sequence. Can you please put two blue pegs and one pink peg? Can you put one purple peg and one pink peg? And so on. Now remove only the blue pegs. By doing this activity repeatedly, the learner will become quite familiar with all the different colors and be able to identify the colors and follow instructions, all the while improving their pincer grip and their hand-eye coordination. Thanks for watching.